Hey, my lover. Welcome to my mom's channel. <laughs> Bye. Is, but it looks like a hot mess, so let's start from up here. And I'm trying to see if I can find any. I hate when it does that. Oh, there is one. Alright, anyways. So, The Sims 4. The reason why I stopped playing it is because I got really freaking bored of it to be honest and I was just tired of it. I was just tired of all the fucks up, fuck ups. Sorry, excuse my language. I seriously cannot talk today. I was just, I was just tired of it all. Like, they always had excuses for everything. Like, and I just got tired of it. I got tired of my game always having problems, I got tired of the glitches, um, I got tired of the loading screen being so slow even though my computer is like 100% like perfectly fine. Um, I run scans on it all the time to make sure that it's doing good and you know it really bothers me that a game that I love so much is just always broken like it really it got to a point where my motivation to play that game like just fell through because it's like like I said they just didn't have any more motivation and really listening to us and fixing it yeah I get that they made a new pack um, the snowy expansion or whatever it's called um, and then they fixed the color wheel, they added in more um, reasonable um, skin tones, they fixed um, a lot of hairs <clears throat> specifically for black people, um, and no, I'm not racist, I'm just specifying it, um, but I just got I got tired of it because even though they fixed the skin tones, okay, everybody complimented the skin tones, yada yada yada, it was done, right? But no, um, some of the skin tones still needed to be worked on and some of the hair still needed to be tweaked on. So it's just like, why? Why do we have to like, how do I say it? Why do we have to wait? For them to fix and add more gameplay into the game you know what I mean like why is it that why is it the fact that modders okay you know people that mod so why is it the fact that modders can do it better than they can it's like really sad like like why like why can oh I don't remember his name but he created a mod where you're literally able to go in a whole new world and you're able to even create a whole new world like I don't I don't get it I really don't understand the Sims franchise because in the beginning it was like wow like amazing but then throughout the years it just got really freaking boring and it was the same old excuse that they were going to fix everything but every time they said that they came out with a new pack and it's like why why did you have to come out with a new pack knowing that the game from beginning to the middle still needs to be fixed and worked on like I just it just it just like blows my mind so honestly that's that's the whole reason why I stopped playing it because um I just got bored of it and another thing is because I'm not gonna keep 
downloading. Oh, sorry, I yawned. Uh, but what I was saying was, I'm not gonna keep downloading uh, mods when I know my computer cannot handle it that well. Like, I know, like, I'm not gonna lie, my computer is not that freaking great, but here I am, still playing games and still trying my best to record and, um, where did I put the cotton seeds? But yeah, like, here I am, still trying to record, still trying to stream as much as I can. I do apologize that I haven't really been on much for Twitch or for YouTube. And that's just because I've been really busy. Oh, I got a laundry? No way. But anyways, yeah, like, that's just, that's the reason why, like, I just haven't been motivated to play it. And it's just because it just got boring, like, not to be mean or whatnot. I know there's a lot of people out there that love the game, and let me tell you, I love the game too. It's just, like, there's too many damn problems on it that they need to work on. And it's sad that we gotta keep repeating ourselves constantly so they can fix it. Like, you know what I mean? Like, we shouldn't have to be wasting our breath. And it's just sad. It really is. Dude, why were they separated? That's so weird. Um, oh, that's not the same. Oh, that's iron ore. Oh, that's not the same as this either. Oh, that's new. Oh, these are new. Oh, that's right. Iron ore and lead ore. <sighs> I totally forgot. Oh, here's the cotton. Alright, um. And. I thought it was done. Oh my god. Where's the fertilizer? There's only one left. Great. Anyways, um. Let's read this. Hi, I'm an old man that loves to play the game of Cross 5 in the park, but here in lies the problem. There are no tables in the park. I had to play it on the ground, so I've decided to make my own. I've contacted many other workshops to commission a stone table and two stone seats, but they all saw it as too much of a commission to take. You're my only hope. This is the easiest. Easiest. This is from Isaac. I know who he is. Easy. Easy peasy thin is easy. Anyways, the Sims just needs to like focus on the game and like fix it already. Like, it's just crazy how we have to be the ones to complain about everything. Like, the only reason why we were able to get skin tones in the hair hair fix was because we complained about it, and it's not and it wasn't just only because of us. It Excellent also... work! I'm impressed. Now I just wait for it to be set up, and we can have a game of Cross Five or Two. Nice, thanks, Isaac. Um, see, relationship ten. It's not that great, but. It takes a while to get relationship in this game. Anyways, um... I need to figure out where I'm putting this battery. First of all. Oh, okay. In the cave. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, we'll go to the cave. Um... But yeah, they just need to focus on the game. It's really upsetting that they don't focus on the game. Like, recently... They've, com they've been collabing a lot i've noticed it so they've collabed with mushino as everybody knows very expensive brand that i would never be able to afford to be honest 
So they've collabed with them. They've collabed with MAC for the makeup, which I hated. I hated it. Honestly, I hated it. It was nothing good about it. Um, the makeup was horrible. I didn't like it. Not my type of style. Maybe everybody else's type of style, but it definitely wasn't my type of style. I'm surveying this cave. The man wants me to set up a haunted cave here. If you're going in, stock up on health items, since it's still dangerous inside. <sighs> Yay, I met Louis... Liwa? Liwa? I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Anyways, we gotta go in the cavern because we gotta place this battery. Um, and I'm definitely gonna post this on my YouTube. But just the part of where I'm talking about those imps, of course. Um. <laughs> oh. Um. So yeah, back what I was talking about. So they did a few collabs. Machino was okay. Um, the Mac was just, I didn't like it, honestly. It was awful. Um, then they just started doing these shady, um, darn it, what's it called? Commercials, which were 0% accurate. How come this is 10? This is a hundred. God. That one's way better. Alright, you know what? Let's put this stuff in our house because we need to put it in our house for more health. Um, the washing machine and the mirror. Uh, hold on, that one's way too off. It didn't even look like it was connected to the wall. Uh, and then the mirror. I'll put it there. <coughs> I hate when I talk too much and my voice starts like giving up on me and it's like, oh my god. Super annoying. Um, let me see. I hate when I do that. No, no, we, I didn't say go in your house. <sighs> We're trying to check if you have more food. Let's see. That just restores stamina. I don't need that. <sighs> stamina. This restores HP. use that I honestly didn't know might need all the meat that I can get honestly cuz none of the food that I have will work <sighs> heavy breathing the fur oh boots in the fur up the hole I'm looking there oh my god I can't be doing that don't fucking like mute my whole damn video just for singing a damn song that everybody knows <laughs> all right so it says I can use this clock oh where do you place it in your house <laughs> and... Max health 14. You know what? I'm about to place two of them. Fuck it. Place two of them. We need as much health as we need. 605 health. I think that's good. I think that's good. Let me make sure I don't have to know. Oh! <gasps> oh! I 
I locked more. Awesome. All right. Let's go back. Cause your girl fucked up the first time, but she ain't about. She ain't about to fuck up the second time. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> wow, my throat's like really annoying today. But yeah, back, back. I always keep losing track of what I'm talking about, and I hate that. It's like I can't keep, I can't stay on one topic. But they started doing these weird, fancy commercials. That, what is this? Oh, resin. That came nowhere near to being accurate. Like, for an example, if you um, look it up. Uh, oh yeah, the gloves are way better. What? These really cringy commercials that like were not accurate as as ever. Um, for example, there was this mermaid one that um. was just extreme BS. There was a mermaid in a bathtub that was eating food. And <laughs> yes, the mermaid can be in the bathtub, but you cannot eat at the same time in the bathtub. You can't, it's not possible. Unless if there's a mod. Um, so that's one example. The other example is that there's a there was a guy pooping in a house in front of a TV, um, and a real estate comes in trying to um, uh, sell the house with other people. Let's go. So, yeah, I mean, yeah, you can poop in your own house in The Sims in front of a TV if you really wanted to in your living room, but there's no real estate. Bring it. Um, they were doing all these bogus ass commercials that were half accurate for The Sims 4, and they only did that because they wanted more money on top of that and they wanted more um you know more people to buy the game because it's on sale right now it's five dollars hippie so they did all those bogus commercials spent all that money on the bogus commercials um basically just to sell off more of the game and that kind of aggravated a lot of people because a lot of people expected more from the sims franchise they expected the game for one to be fixed and not broken all the time and two they wanted um, other people to be able to play the game as well so like for them to go and do something like that really made a lot of people pissed like not even joking like there was a lot of people that were like um what are you doing um instead of making bogus commercials y'all should be up in here fixing the sims because even its base game pack was like really broken and that's like sad Oh, I can make more cotton. I forgot. Where's the seeds for the cotton? Here it is. And I'm gonna go buy some more. Um. Fertilizer. Because I can't make it yet. I didn't make the... I haven't made the machine yet. I didn't get the... Dude, it, this game sucks on the computer. <laughs> I mean, the graphics is way better than the Switch, but 
I definitely defeated that snail, like, with no problems on the Switch. And... Apparently it's much more harder on the damn computer. Where's the fertilizer? Here it is. I'll buy 10 for 100. Why not? Yay! Um... So yeah, like... That's the only whole reason why I stopped playing the game. Was it really... It, it wasn't really to like boycott the game. Like, I don't want to like say that because it just sounds wrong. Because that's not the type of person that I am. But I honestly just stopped playing it because I got bored of it. I got sick and tired of downloading mods on my computer to fix the game when... The Sims, in general, should be the ones fixing their damn game. But they created the game, but they keep coming out with all these game packs, all these expansion packs, and they don't want to fix the game. So it's like, how is that fair for us? We have to play with a game that's broken? Like, that's not fair. You know what I mean? Like, that's, that's horrible. It's really horrible. So that's why I've been like... You know, I've been thinking about downloading it again and playing it again, but I just don't have no motivation at all because I just know, what day is it? Oh, it's a weekend, so there's no commissions. Fuck. Um, I guess we can go mine because clearly I can't defeat the stupid snail. It's Gus. He's oh, so Oh, the house handsome. seems to have been broken in by a thief. It is none of your business. How fucking rude, Gus. Damn, I liked it better when they didn't um, talk. That Sunday fireside makes me sleepy. Ew. Because on the Switch, they don't talk. That's why I find it weird that on, on the PC, they talk. Uh, there's a lot of things that the Switch doesn't have that the PC version has, which I really find interesting. Unless if I just... didn't notice it yet. But I'm pretty damn sure they don't talk on the Switch. Dude, the game is so broken it's not even fucking funny. Like, it's sad that modders, you know, people who mod the game and mod stuff for the game are the only ones fixing the game. Like, it just goes to show that they kind of, like, gave up on the game. And I don't want to, like, say anything without it being true, but this is just my opinion and my point of view. I feel like they just gave up on it. That's why they came out with all those expansion packs. Didn't really give a flying fuck about the other packs that were broken. Dude. Dine Out, which is like... I think it was like the third pack that they come out. They came out They came out with. Jesus, I can't talk today. That's like the third or fourth pack that they came out with. And it's so broken, it's not even funny. Like, my sim, for an example, would go sit in the restaurant that they had for the dino and there's a person that you're supposed to walk up to that's like near a stand and then you click on them and you ask them to sit you down somewhere and they're supposed to sit you down right yo one time i did that my sim literally stood there for like almost two hours in like sim time you know they sat there for like almost two hours in sim time and it was just like what the fuck and like the food's broken too like the server is supposed to bring back your food and sometimes they don't show up for like hours so you're like sitting there like talking and talking and talking to your date let's say for hours without your food like it's broken and it's fucked up that they don't want to fix it. It's like, and it's not just the dine out. There's also many other packs that I can't really think of right now because I'm like, 
<laughs> I like am super brain dead with the sips, but what were the what were the other ones? Uh, no, taller stuff was a stuff pack. Oh, Jungle Adventures. That one also became very broken. Oh my! Don't even get me started with Island. Island was it Island Paradise? Now I don't even remember. It's Island something, right? It was an expansion pack as well. Pretty sure it was an expansion pack. And my lord, that game! Every time a new update came out, or a new pack came out, or a stuff pack came out, that game would always get broken. It was cr it it was just ridiculous. In one of my challenged sims that I had on there for one of the challenges that I was doing was living in the island and she felt like such a loner too because there was barely anybody on that island so that was like another problem too it's like almost as if they like I don't even know how to explain it. It's like almost as if they like took out some sims to like not show up or like tourists because they're supposed to be tourists on the on that pack and it almost seems as if they like fucked up the tourism on it. It's just it's just messed up. Like I like I said, I love the Sims, but they just need to get their shit together and fix it already cuz people are people are bored like i i i can't even watch my favorite youtubers that actually play the sims i can't watch any other videos because it's just so depressing it's like i feel like it's always the same shit that they try to upload but they just change the title like, and I get notifications all the time on my regular YouTube that they uploaded something. And I'll look at it, and if it's The Sims, I won't even watch it. Because I'm just so disappointed on how repetitive it is. It just sucks. That's why I've been mostly playing different games like for example this game it's called my time at Porsche or Porta because apparently that's how the game says it because that's how she said it when I first played this game on the PC so I've been saying it wrong all these years can you believe that it's my time at Porta not Porsche. I don't know why I would always say it like that. I don't know why I thought the T was a CH. Porsche, like, come on. Come on, Luana, get your shit together. But right now, we're just mining. I'm trying to see if I can collect some more ores and some secret shit that are hiding. So that orb is basically something that I'm gonna find, like, what is it? A valve, I found a valve. So, um, that's why I have those goggles on. It helps me find very um, exclusive items that I might need for builds. This game's really fun too because not only can you do not only can you build stuff for other characters in this game and do missions and do commissions for other people, um, you if you get your relationship relationship up very high, wow, I'm telling you, like my brain is dead today, like it doesn't want to talk. If you get your relationship up high enough with um, a person, doesn't matter, boy or girl, you will be able to either be in a relationship with them or I think be like best friends with them or something like that it's pretty cool um on the switch I've been focusing on one 
guy. Oh, but I don't remember his name. Oh, I found a soldier with a scepter piece. And no, I didn't die. She just passed out because it was time to go to sleep. Oh, fuck, which one? Fuck. God damn it, McDonald. I forgot. I don't even think I have enough cotton for ya. How do you do, Builder? <sighs> do you have the money to pay off your debts? No, bitch. Why, you? Get him! What the fuck? Now I have to fight? I thought... Hello there! Ah! Ah! Uh, uh. How the f- How the fuck did I lose? <sighs> Good day, gentlemen. Finally, Arlo! Now you wanna Arlo. fucking show up? What do we do? Picking on a newcomer. That's pretty low. You guys are under arrest. Right away! <laughs> Get back here! Now he wants to show up after I fucking lose in a fight? That son of a bitch. <gasps> I got a crafter's toolbox. So cute. <laughs> Yay! But I also don't have no wharf in storage. Yay! If you guys haven't already, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you don't, give me a thumbs down. And if you haven't, please don't forget to click that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, make sure it's on all so anytime I post a new video, you will get a notification by me of my new video of course <laughs> thank you guys so 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 much for all your support bye my llamas <laughs>